Hi guys, Rachie Bob here. The Sims Mobile has had an update, so be sure to update your app. If you don't have it automatically there, you need to go into the App Store, click the Updates tab and just pull down to Refresh and it should show the update. I've just done it. So here's what's new, here's the patch notes. I will put a link so you can read them down in the comments, but I'm just going to go through and show you what I can because some of it isn't actually live yet. So it says, welcome to our first ever patch notes for The Sims Mobile. We've heard your request for patch notes and we're eager to begin sharing more updates on new features and improvements being made to the game. Below is a highlight of several exciting updates happening version 10.0.0 now available for download. Well, that's quite loud. Okay, my Sim is manically on the piano. That's actually a glitch because she's actually in the writing hobby some reason she plays on the piano I don't know so there's a new limited time event which I'm very excited about it's express your style with the sims mobile and ASOS if you didn't know I'm obsessed with ASOS I have their premier subscription service and use them all the time they're like an online fashion store originally I mean this is how long I've shopped there they used to be called as seen on screen which is what ASOS stands for you used to be able to go on type of celebrity and find everything that they're wearing but now it's just fashion from april 19th that so starts tomorrow to may 2nd you can participate in the asos fashion show and become a fashionista i would love to have seen the pitch meeting for that how on earth did they get asos to agree to come into the game it's incredible it's so great like it just shows you that they could literally put any angle on this for collaboration so i'm excited to see what else they do in the future unlock the asos spring collection for your sims and score a discount for asos.com yes please new career within the asos fashion show unlock and build your sims camera skills with the new photography career now i presume that that's going to come in with the ASOS live event because you can't do the ASOS fashion show until the 19th so I presume that comes with that. I haven't looked but I figure. Then more events at venues. We've expanded the number of relationship events outside your sims homes. You can even take occasional field trips to venue locations you haven't unlocked yet. Very cool. I haven't noticed any of that yet in my particular events but then that's just gonna pop up like organically I think. Sticker hub you can now see how many stickers each sim has earned during the given week via the new sticker hub. Go to the sims info panel. Yeah. Oh I guess that's it. Sticker third tab along. Ah, she's not hardly had any. Does it do any of my sims? Let's try the ones that are at home first. Oh gosh. To be fair, I haven't been to any parties this week. And I think the week only updated like yesterday, so... Oh, she's got two cool ones. More stickers means more easy tokens, so that's worth pursuing and making sure that you push more. So now I can see I'm not getting many, I can maybe interact a little bit more in parties and things. Other improvements, the quest menu has been given a makeover it should now be easier to distinguish limited time quests let's have a look it looks the same to me but then that will probably come into play when the asos quest pops on there and it's maybe a different color or something like that we'll see tomorrow like foliage you're in luck new trees and plants are now available for your home decoration <gasps> Where's the star? Where's it gone? Oh, I'm not at home. Oh, delightful daffodils. Oh, they're so nice. Oh, sprightly sunflowers. Oh, they're very, very beautiful. Why can't I? Yeah. Oh, there's so many new beautiful flowers. I need to calm down. I don't want to spend all my sim cash, but look. These are just a couple of them. There's at least four new ones that I saw there. Wow! I love those. I might need to move them, but I love them. Very nice for spring. Optimizations around saving game and reducing the amount of lost progress. Good. 
And then some bug fixes. It says, addressed an issue where players were not receiving their items from store purchasers. Fixed an issue where the incorrect sim was being displayed on an event collection. Not sure about that. We'll see when she's finished her writing event and see if that works. Because sometimes when this sim finishes her writing event, it'll say that she's leveled up in the photography event, in the photography skill instead of the writing skill. So we'll see how that works. Fixed several graphical corruption issues including risky actions so that's the one with the expanding sims <laughs> fixed an issue where players were unable to move move objects while trying for a baby good fixed a variety of interactions where child sims were being stretched fixed an issue where parties were recommending the incorrect careers to players fixed an issue where with babies not appearing in the crib or being interacted with is my baby there yeah my baby's there good get off the piano Fixed an issue where sims could not be retired via the sim info panel. I don't know if I've got anyone ready to retire. And overall dozens of other bug fixes and polish improvements. Thank you for reading. Well, so that's a lovely update and I'm really excited for that ASOS event. If you would like to see it covered, I will cover it over on my gaming channel. It's just youtube.com forward slash richbopgaming. I'll put a link in the description. And so when that starts going, when that goes live, I'll see how it plays out and see how coverable it will be. And hopefully unlock myself a discount. Let me know how you're getting on in game. Good luck with the ASOS fashion show and the photography career. Quite excited for that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.